Christ, it's Eddie the Magic Monk. Eddie the Magic Monk. Eddie the Magic Monk. Eddie the Magic Monk. Hey guys, it's Eddie the Magic Monk. Welcome to another Google Pixel tutorial. As you guys would have heard, if you have a Google Pixel phone, you can have as many videos and photos backed up using Google Photos as you want. So what does that mean? If I go into my Google Photos app and I see all of these photos here and videos here, videos and photos that I've taken previously, they have already been backed up using Google Photos. They've already been uploaded onto Google Photos so I could share them with anyone in the world with just a link. So, how would you set this up? So if you click on your profile picture button on the top right, if it says backup complete, that means it's already been backed up. Okay, every single one of your photos is already on Google Photos. If you have photos that you have not backed up, so if I go to my picture app and I take a few pictures with my phone, and then I quickly go to Google Photos, you'll see that it no longer says backup complete. It's backing up the files that I have just uh, stored are created on my phone. It's backing them up. Now it says backup complete. And it only does this via Wi-Fi. Okay, if you have that option ticked, it'll only do it on Wi-Fi so you won't use your mobile data. Now, once things are backed up, what happens now is these three photos that I've just taken, they're on both Google Photos and on my phone. Now, if you think about it, Google Photos is giving you unlimited storage, but your phone only has, let's say, 100 gigabytes. Your phone's going to run out of storage if you keep the photo on both places. So what you need to do is click on your profile picture and choose free up space. If you choose free up space, then what it does is it will delete the photos on your phone, but still keep them on Google Photos. So if I click free up 14 megabytes, click that button. Okay, what happens now is it says you freed up 3.66 megabytes. So all of these photos that you can see in my phone from Google Photos, they are no longer on my phone. They are all on the internet. So how would you know that? How would you know whether a photo is on your phone? If you turn off the internet, I'm going to do that right now. The internet is off and then I click on one of these photos that I've just taken. Okay, it won't load anymore. It's not going to load because all of these photos, some of them are still loading. I'm not sure why, but if I click free up space, um, a video, for example, it's not going to load, okay, because it's not on my phone. It's not on my phone. It's going to need the internet. It has to have the internet. If I turn on the internet, then it'll play. Okay, then it's going to play, it's going to play these videos. Okay, so that's how Google Photos works on your phone. Now, one last thing is how would you turn the backups on and off? You click the profiles, you go to um, photo settings, you can go to backup and sync. And here is where you can go down to Upload size, choose storage saver if you want to have unlimited space. Now just make sure that you understand that it's not going to keep the photos and videos at full quality. Okay, so it might lose a little bit of quality, but most of the time it's pretty acceptable. Mobile data usage, make sure you click um, Daily limit for backup, no data. So it's not going to use your mobile data. Otherwise, you'll run out very quickly. Um, and then backup and sync, turn it off. It's no longer going to be backing your files up. So if it no longer backs up your files, what happens is you take any new pictures 
if I take some new pictures now, three pictures, right? The three extra pictures that I've taken, they'll only be on my phone. They won't be backed up to Google Photos. So if you click on your profile picture, it'll say backup is off. And you click backup is off. You got the three photos here that are not backed up. Okay, and you can obviously select them and put them on the photo, uh, Google Photos yourself. So now it's uploading it. Uh, it's it's still going to upload them, so now it's uploading them manually uh, to the cloud. So select, choose them. Oops, is it, it's, it's already on the cloud. Okay, I was too slow. It's already on the cloud. Um, so if you click this button, backup complete. Uh, so you, it doesn't have to be automatic, but obviously it's going to help if it's automatic. Again, free up space free up space and now all your uh, photos are deleted from your phone but they exist on Google Photos. So that's a quick snapshot of how Google Photos works with your Pixel. Thanks for watching guys. See you next time.